So this is the second part of the MRVP test. Remember in the first video we talked about MR stands for methyl red, the VP stands for Volks Proskauer. In this test you're going to be looking for the alcohol fermentation product called acetoin. In order to perform the Volks Proskauer test, takes about one mil out of each of your test tubes and put them into a clean separate tube. After that, you're going to add the first reagent which is called alpha naphthol solution. You need to put exactly 12 drops of this solution in each tube. Then you're going to add an additional 4 drops of the VP2 reagent which is 40% potassium hydroxide and again that's four drops of potassium hydroxide. After that you want to take your tubes, aerate them as I'm doing here. Notice the color change, kind of a greenish color and you're going to notice a lot of bubbles on top but you want to get as much oxygen in there to in, uh, initiate the reaction as possible. Now you're going to set your timer and this could take anywhere from 15 to 30 minutes for the reaction to occur. If you have to wait longer than one hour, you have an invalid reaction. Okay, so my reaction took just about 18 minutes. Notice in this tube you have a cherry red color. The bubbles are still on top in both tubes, but this cherry red color means that acetoin was produced and this would be a positive VP reaction. The other tube, notice, is kind of a brownish color. Sometimes it can also be copper. However, it's not red. So the appearance uh, that you see here would indicate a negative VP reaction.